So this is kind of like a viewer request. We have a viewer, Eric, asking some questions about the wiring of his Ego Pack. And after some comments back and forth, he does want to know the wiring of a 2.5 amp hour Ego Pack. So instead of trying to comment back and forth or figure out how to share some photos, I figured the best thing may be just to, to do a quick video. So I'm assuming this is what he has, is a kind of like this wiring I saved off of a pack, where he does have what we'll call your low and your high side of the pack, uh, individual monitoring wires, as, as well as your NTC. He stated that he had took one apart and saved the, um, I guess the BMS and all the wiring, but he was gonna one day replace the cells, and now he's just asking, where's the proper place to put the wiring? So it seems like the best thing to do might just be to, uh, to do a video. So I'm just gonna cut this off so we can see a little bit better. So he'll be able to take this video or anybody else who might find this helpful and you'll see exactly where the wires are routed. we're going to call this one our low side and call this one our high side because as we remember we can go across and check B1 through B7 and B8 through B14 so the side that this one plugs into I'm just calling the low side so the low side will be the one that has the yellow on the right and the NTC is on the left as it plugs in and the high side will be the NTC on the right it ends up with a um after the green then it's a black wire at the end and of course he probably has his connector already together but that's how it's laid out i'm assuming he kept these tabs here but there's a shot of where they go of course so we do notice on the on the low pack that the wiring goes to this side the cell pack that's actually closer to the BMS. From this pack we have the, the yellow, we see the red, the green, the blue, black and a white, and we see that our NTC is right here with some silicone just somewhere on this, this part of the pack. And the red is connected through and also in this spot goes into our high side connector the black one goes there and monitors at that point. They just use that for convenience instead of tacking it on there. But And this pack goes around and we have our green here. Blue. There's our NTC potted in there. Then white. Red. Yellow. And brown. So even though I know that was tough to follow if you trace it out, this right here is what you get. Our low side wires in respect to our, our main black wire. And with it, with it plugged into the BMS, you can actually use that test point ground right there in the bottom right. But respect back to negative. On the low side, the blue is 4, then black is 8, and it goes accordingly down to the yellow down to 24 volts for sales 1 through 6. And sales 7 through 13 come back on our high side on the left here. And start off on the left with the black wire at 28 volts. These are all nominal values, of course. Uh, 28 volts all the way down through the brown at 52 volts. So that brown one right there on the right, close to the NTC, I'll be our 52 volts. And then how our B14 gets to 56 volts is back from the main red. It's coming back to the board right here. So it's connected through here on this main connector and coming back to the BMS here. So if nothing else, this sheet right here will probably help you out. So Eric, I hope that answers your questions. Anybody else having some issues or questions about how the BMS hooks up afterwards, hope that helps you out. If it does, please like, share, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Have fun.